So today in this video, I'm going to tell you how Allah gives permission to fight with the transgressors. Surah Baqarah verse number 194 where Allah says, So whoever has assaulted you, then assault him in the same way that he has assaulted you. And fear Allah and know that Allah is with those who fear him. So this verse is basically about fighting in the Ramadan where Allah says, If the unbelievers fight you in this holy month, and all the other three months which are considered sacred. If they fight with you in these months, then permission is granted to you to fight them. And it was actually quoted by the Yemeni resistance. So as you know, the transgressors have started their aggression on Yemen. Now it's Yemen's turn. And Allah is saying that you must fight back. They have crossed your boundaries. They have assaulted you. Now it's your turn. And we know that Yemen has not stopped their operations in the Red Sea. So it's evident that Yemen is not going to stop because they follow this verse. They follow Allah's command and they only fear Allah. And Allah says in this verse that whoever fears him, he will be with those people. And the only people who fear Allah in this war is our resistance. That's why Allah is with them. Despite being attacked by the transgressors, we have seen they have just in these two days again seized some more ships. They never stopped their operations in the Red Sea. This tells us how firm they are in their religion, in their belief, in their stand. What Yemenis say, they mean it. They have stated in the past that they are with the residents in the war region, the occupied area. And they will not stop their operations until food and other basic needs are provided to the people of occupied area. And so far, they have followed this statement. They never back off from this statement. And when they are being attacked, it's not possible that they will stop their operations. And they have said many times in their statements, and it's not just Yemeni forces, the other resistance in the occupied areas. They have quoted this that they only fear Allah. And by the command of Allah, they are fighting this war. It also makes it clear that they are the people who fear Allah actually. And this verse is particularly for these people. And because they only fear me, that's why I'm with them. If you only fear Allah, you don't have any fear for others. Then you are really committed to your goal and you never back off from your duties. It's not just for the resistance, it's for all the common people. That if you fear Allah, then you will stick to your goals. And if you fear others, then you cannot be on the right path. So inshallah, Allah is with them and Allah will give them victory over this whole entire evil entity.